Alright guys, and welcome back to more Persona Q Shadow of the Labyrinth. Last time we learned the backstory of Ray, and throughout this entire game I've been giving Ray shit, and now I, I kind of feel kind of bad. So, damn. That's how it is. You know things are getting real when the damn main hub area changes colors and the music just changes you know it's getting real then when the characters are actually sitting and talking to each other seriously not playing around running running around chasing each other in the background nope shit has got serious it took 90 hours for this game to get serious so what we're <laughs> what we're about to do is go into the velvet room to see if we can fuse up any new personas any got like personas here welcome to the velvet room also came in here to see if marie was going to perform one last poem for us Nope. Let's go ahead and change that up. We got 78% of the personas added to our compendium. I have 78 persona. I created 78% of the personas here. Oh, we can get Trumpeteer, dude. Angelic Trumpet. Mm, wow. Cocooling. Oh, that's right. I don't need Cocooling no more. Damn, I can make uh, this Angelic Trumpeteer. Is that the, the same move he had in Nocturne? Three heavy bash attacks against random targets. Interesting. I bet you the Kakulin, yep, the Kakulin one is better. What about this one? This one seems. Moraku Kaja. That's not really good at all. Damn, the, so the Sojo would pretty much carry over everything. Whatever, I'm going to give away all the characters I'm not using. All the, uh, personas I'm not using. Na, 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 na. We made it to the end game, y'all. We're almost done with this game. To be honest, I'm kind of glad. Because them labyrinths was just pissing me off. <laughs> not to the point where it's like, man, these labyrinths are hard. It's just, they just lasted too long. Like, traversing the labyrinth shouldn't have took as long as they did. Alright, we got Barong. We got Belfagor. We already created him, though. That's how I got Triple Link, I think. No, that's how I got Binding Hands. I can make Barong. We got Ishtar. Da -da 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 -da. We can make Cert. Cert can bring the hurt. Can he get mirrored arrows? Oh yeah, he can. Thing is, Mara is better. Mara is kind of better. He has, he has more HP, more SP. Cert, uh, he has absorbed fire. Oh wait, this actually might be better. Now that I think about it. Hmm. Cause look at this, the only reason why I have Chie with Mara is actually because Exoid Fire, that's one of the reasons why I gave it to Chie, because she needs to cover her weakness, right? And on top of that, for Mirrored Arrows, can I carry over Demon Stab? Yes, I can. Moragi Dine, I don't need that. She's never going to use that. She doesn't need Stagnant Air, because she'll never use that. So I might actually get rid of Mara. I think I will get rid of Mara. All right, let's get rid of Mara. Let's give her. Let's give Cert mirrored arrows. Shinkuha. Shinkuha is actually very useful because it hits twice, and she has a high chance of getting critical hits. So if I need an easy critical hit, so I can get a free power charge, giving giving uh, Cert Shinkuha would actually be pretty cool. Um, Fort Sphere, yeah, and Demon. Yeah, demon stab, definitely. We got mirrored is this arrows. The persona you want? Yes, give me that cert. Looks like cert's about to bring the hurt. It's like fuck that dick. I can bring the hurt, the real hurt, cause I'm cert. You won't be forgetting me anytime soon. The persona cert has emerged from the sea of your soul. The sea of your soul. 
Oh yeah, Personas. I mean, Chie is knocked out. I forgot about that. Rai Jinzon. Deathbound. Rebel Spirit. I wonder if he has links. If Masakado has links, he actually might be a better person for uh, for I guess. Chie needs to equip Cert. Bam. Da, 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 da. Look at that. Shinkuha. Fork Spear. Fork Spear is actually pretty good because it allows her to attack twice if she does a skill. No, no, no. It, I think it's just normal attacks. Whatever. Let's look at the Compendium now. We have 79% done. Can we get 80% maybe with another Persona? Barong? Nope. Biako? Ah, screw it. I will see you again. Alright, I guess we're done in the fusion room. I guess what we want to do now... What the fuck? Where did that spider come from, homie? Get the fuck off my screen! Get your spider ass out of here. Ain't nobody tell you to hang your webs up, dog. So anyway, we need to go to the workshop. See what we can get from this item we got from this last boss fight. Oh. It seems you have something quite rare with you. This is... What if I were to do this, and then do that there? Come up with a new idea. Please wait here a moment. Nice, he's come up with a new item. <laughs> dig it, dig it, do. What did he give us? A dragon belt? What does that do? Increases critical hit damage by a lot? <sighs> that sounds like it. A critical hit to the nads. Chie is still dead. Allows word to use the skill Dragon Cry. If I'm not mistaken, Dragon Cry makes you go first and makes you do a lot of damage. But the thing is, I have Alpha Drive already. I already have Alpha Drive, so why would I want... You know what? You know what? You know what? I guess could use Dragon Cry. Power Charge. Dragon Cry or Gia Mode. Oh my god. That would give us more time to set up Death Chaser too. So you know what? We gotta get this Dragon Cry ability, yo. We gotta get that. We get, we gotta find some way to get money though. I await your next visit. Dragon Cry? Just think if I gave a sure I didn't say to boo. <gasps> yo! I think Orgia mode is a better sa or is a it's a it's a safer Orgia mode is basically a safer Shura Tensei. That's all it is. So I guess what we're gonna do here is actually I guess we'll check out the nurse's office because there might be one or two uh, quests we can do. Welcome. Damn, it's all dark and shit. Defeat the festival dudes. Defeat the festival dudes. Foe within the Inaba Pride exhibit. I guess we'll do these quests. I guess we'll do these quests then. Thank you. Defeat the festival dudes in FOE that it resides in the Inaba Pride exhibit. Please bring back a nice eyebrow as proof of having defeated one. The FOE in question can be found in Night 2 and Night 4. They may prove to be quite a challenge for you, which is why I would like to share some of my wisdom with you. A festival is a religious service and these things have a proper etiquette that must be followed. It is a fighting festival. Then it is only natural that you make it fair fight with the same number of people. Perhaps you can challenge them with some fellow boys to make this a true test of masculinity. Hmm. May luck be with you. Is there some kind of a a system where you need to fight with only dudes? You have to fight with only dudes to beat those guys? I beat them several times by inflicting panic on them where they couldn't do anything else. I don't know. Lost prototype arrow. We might as well do that too. We gotta go to night you... four. This quest is I'll go get them now. Theo! I apologize for the wait. Thank you very much. I entered the end of a pride exhibit to test the arrows I developed. However, my hand slipped and you see these arrows got stuck in the floor 
of a southwestern room within with an FOE on night four. The arrows are named the Theodore Mark 64, Theodore Mark 65, and 66. Of the three, I must say that Theodore Mark 66 is my masterpiece. I will be counting on you. I'm sorry to make you go through all this trouble, but I would like you to recover that one for me. So he wants me to get Mark 66. Theo. Why don't you recover your arrow? Why don't you go recover your arrows yourself? If you don't do what you're capable of, the only future you have is becoming a useless pig. Damn! I, a pig? I'm sorry. <laughs> I tried to fetch it myself, but the FOEs began to gather, making it difficult to do so. <sighs> At one point, they brought out a portable shrine from somewhere, and it was too much for me to handle. So you know what? That's our place. We gotta go. We gotta go beat their asses. Get, we gotta go fight a festival dude anyway, right? So we gotta go beat those guys up and get the arrows easily. I see. Then I suppose it really couldn't be helped. If I recall, those arrows that's... are made of a special material that renders them invisible unless under direct light. You'll need to illuminate the area with your torchlight. It may not be much, but I have lit all the bonfires in the area to make it easier for. Oh, that makes sense. Why there was there was an area where I couldn't figure out why I couldn't light the bonfire and why it was there, but now I know why because it was used for a quest. Okay. But da 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 da. I'm afraid this is the best I can do. Well then. It is a request from my foolish brother, but I would appreciate it if you would do it. All right, I guess we're gonna spend our time here doing these quests. Um. Damn, even Karamaru or Teddy's looking down. So we gotta go fight the festival dudes, which are actually pretty fucking tough. And we need to pretty much make sure everybody's equipped properly. We got Alpha Drive, all around badge. I really want to give her something else. I gave him Aang goggles so he can land his skills a lot faster. I got him with the magic luck reverse because who uses magic in this da game to do damage? Like, let's be honest. It may have been good in Nocturne, but not in Persona. <laughs> or excuse me. In Nocturne, you also use physical abilities. Which game had good magic? I think it was Soul Hackers. Soul Hackers was all about magic. And then Nocturne was all about strength. And this game is all about strength as well. About physical skills. So we just saved our game. And what we're going to do. We're not going to view the strolls yet. We're not going into the clock tower yet. We're going back to the Inaba Pride. We're going to start from the final floor. I wonder if there's going to be a secret boss for this too. Play that creepy music, oh yeah. Play that, play that. Oh my god, do I have to walk around? Oh no, 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 that's a sealed door. I don't need a bonfire. I was assuming that I would need the bonfire to get through this floor. I would have been salty. But anyway, we gotta go look at the southwest corner. Digga, digga, do. Yep, in that area with the FOEs. We gotta go fight those guys anyway. So this all works out. Alright, we got... Oh, we need to come over here for three reasons. To fight the FOE, to get the Mark 40... Or 67. And then we gotta get... That chest down there I never picked up. So let me go to... Request. Digga, 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 digga. All right, so here we go, guys. Let's go. So we need to go southwest. Let's go. And before we fight the FOE, we might as well get this chest. It might oh, a have a good item somewhere. in there. Oh wow. Hmm. I wonder why the sparkly enemy is so sparkly. <laughs> <laughs> it's making me anxious. That's like asking. How do they get the little M's on the M&M's? <laughs> How do they get that on the little M&M's? Nobody knows, right? <laughs> Opulent hand smirks. I got you, my guy. Y'all better kill me right now. Oh shit, they got me in that agility lock shit. 
Yo, calm down. Calm down, man. I ain't doing that. I'm just walking around. I'm counting on you, Messiah. I'm just walking around like a little hen. What the? <laughs> oh, man. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me, bro. Sir, bring in the hurt. Do, 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 do. Yeah, sir, bring in the hurt. No more dick jokes, guys. No more dick jokes. I, I apologize. No more dick jokes today. Because Mara has been upgraded to Sir. The treasure box begins to glow mysterious. Whatever. Four coins? I, I can do that. Next week I'm going to have a lot of coins because I'm going to a convention. The Ring of Darkness. Something completely and utterly useless because... Is it gets beats out by a whole bunch of other things. Yeah, look at that. Dude, we got homunculus for that shit. I should sell the fuck out of that, but I'm not. So we got the chest on this floor. We gotta go fight this FOE. Let's try to get a back attack. We wanna try to get a back attack on these guys. What the He was serious about the FOEs or the FOEs here turning into the ones that carry those portable shrines. Hmm. This will be quite troublesome. When well, the fire is let those FOEs move twice as fast as they usually do. But Without the fire, we won't be able to find Theo's arrows. For crying out Damn it, loud. where the hell did they get that thing anyway? However, Come on, we just gotta do it. Let's find this 66 arrow of his. Let me see. Let's go. Alright, we gotta go get the bonfire, but right now, fuck that. Watch out for that FOE! Check this out. I need to position myself to where they would literally set themselves up. So I gotta b walk back twice. Here we go. I got the back attack. Alright, let's get this back attack going. Nah, we good. We good, we good in the hood. Just make sure you land your damn debuffs! If you don't land your de debuffs, we're screwed. I'm not playing. We're gonna die if you don't land the debuffs. Yeah, Salem's kiss. Tent to the fool! No, he was supposed to do lethargy circle! Fuck! I am misplaying. I am misplaying so hard. We got strength bind. That's that works. That works. That's really good. So they can't really do nothing to us. All right. All right. So sure, Tensei. We're going to orgia mode. Um, I'm gonna debilitate. I'm going to lethargy. Uh, I'm actually gonna death chaser. I'm gonna death chaser again and pray that uh. No, we have to land agility. We have to land this agility shit. So I gotta get I gotta get panic on him. Regardless, I I can't just go in like that. So yeah, I I, I have to actually wait. Before I do anything with I guess so I'm actually gonna do life wall. I don't wanna go into orgy mode until I can set everything up. We want him to do stagnant air. I thought he has stagnant air. <laughs> Alright, I guess we'll have Yosuke do stagnant air. No, no, we really need lethargy circle. I don't want to do anything else unless we get agility bind or panic on there. Let's do tent to the food. I really need agility bind to stick. Thank you! Alright, it's over. We won. Alright, even if we don't get panic, it's good. Because they're already bound. What 
They're strength bound, so they can't really do damage to us. They can attack us, but they can't do damage. There's one more enemy. All right, good. Low on energy, so let's get physical. So what we want to do here is actually Orgia mode. Death Chaser with two people just in case. And what we're going to do with uh, Naru is actually Stagnant Air. And what we're going to do, Death Chaser and Death Chaser. So we're basically setting up for the link attack. And stagnant air will allow us to, you know, keep the bind time on there, the agility bind. Mirrored arrows is about to go ham. That's fine. All right, she still has power charge, so that's good. That's very good. So what I need to do, Bolt Link. I have to spotlight Igis. I have to. She is probably gonna die, but she really needs to do another mirrored arrow so we, she can do a little bit more damage. Tent to the fool. Regularly attack and regularly attack. Come, come on. Persona, rise up. All right, good damage. Persona. Nice. She's gonna die. She's not gonna. She's not gonna be able to kill him. She's gonna be able to do a lot of crits though. Sorry. The eight sixteen. <laughs> That Death Chaser? Boat Link? Please land this! Oh my god! Um, this could be bad. <laughs> YOLO! YOLO's never good when it counts, when it needs to be done. YOLO never works. YOLO never works when we need it to work. But we need it to work here. So I need everybody to attack. I'm gonna still try to put panic on them. I'm gonna still try to put panic on these guys. Nice, you got a crit, so we're gonna be able to do enough damage. Woo! <laughs> Cause otherwise that wasn't gonna do enough. It was not gonna be enough, I believe. Death Chaser, Boat Link. Woo! I think this is gonna be enough. Come on. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> we couldn't count on that 10 to the food, dude. We could not count on that shit. <laughs> we did it. Oh, man. We did it. We pulled it out. You gained the Persona Ishtar. Well, that's that. Those backup strats. Those backup strats are too good. <laughs> like Tent of the Food was supposed to help us out so much in that fight. It was it was basically supposed to prevent them from casting magic, aka casting Darahan to heal themselves. And then Salem's Kiss missed right at the beginning, which was supposed to put them under magic bind at the same time, but I didn't get it, so it sucked. But we defeated the festival dudes. We got the nice eyebrow. Alright, and now we gotta go light up this bonfire. Is 
is at its limits. We gotta get or we gotta get uh, Chie up too. Cause there's a couple of random fights where we need to use mirrored arrows. So let's go ahead and use Samacam. Courtesy of Daiso Bro. Thanks for teaching that to Yosuke. Alright, she really needs to get healed, so I guess what we'll do, use Naru's Meteorama. Go get this bonfire so we can start looking for these arrows. Here I come. The bonfire is lit. If you use the torch on it, you'll receive the holy flame. Holy cow, that was going to be bad. Go. That was going to be insanely bad. But we pulled it out. You found, arrows stuck. you found an arrow stuck in a signboard. Is it 66? I got your back. This will be a piece of cake. I'll do it in an instant. Just watch. And in a sudden motion, Akihiko grabs the arrow. Let's see. It's pretty deep. <laughs> but I'm always up for like a challenge. challenge. <laughs> Akihiko is talking to himself. <laughs> but so are you. The arrow doesn't even budge. <laughs> Pulls the arrow out of the wall. <sighs> The words Theodore Mark 64 are on this arrow. However, Is that so? Try looking for other arrows. Let's just strafe once. They'd probably be in the path. The has gone out. Damn it. They'd probably be in the path where the FOE was. I know exactly what it looked too. It's always probably it's always gonna be in the most inconvenient path. Come on. I'll get this one out in one try. Let me see. I guess this one would just be a half, half a cake instead of a piece. <laughs> <laughs> what, you think you can do better, Shinji? Huh? I didn't say anything about doing it. Hurry up. <laughs> no, go on ahead. If you can do it better, by all means, Mr. Half Cake. <laughs> Look, I didn't mean it like that, you chicken. For crying out loud. I didn't say I was scared to do it either. Out of the way. Shinji rolls up his sleeves. It looks like Shinji is going to try to pull out the arrow this time. Alright, stand back. Let's get this over with. Adios, asshole. <laughs> Shinji struggles to pull the arrow out. The arrow budged a little. Bastard. Son of a bitch. Shinji pulls the arrow! What? Is it it? How deep did this freaking thing go in? Mark 65 on this arrow. Ah, oh, you know what? It's probably... You know what? We probably have to view every single arrow and then it will actually be Mark 66. <laughs> Not this one either. Try looking for the last arrow. Do -do -do. The fire's gone out! Ready to go! The arrow's gone out. Digga 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 do 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 do. Let's go. Yo, look at this. It would be in the center, right? You find an arrow stuck in the signboard. Could this be the Theo Mark 66? <laughs> you couldn't do it either. It took you a while to pull yours out. Don't even think of making some crack about me again, got it? <laughs> Quit talking shit, Shinji. Alright, let's begin. Why don't the three of us do it? Mm -hmm. The three of us? That's true. I guess you have a point. When you think about it, it'll be a lot more efficient than trying it one at a time. However... But we haven't decided who the winner is. Calm down. We can do that later. It's dangerous for us to stay here too long. There's a jar of pickles that won't open back at the door. We can settle a hard dispute with that. Got it. But we're definitely having this pickle contest. You better not try to run away from this. <sighs> Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Seems the two of them have finished trying to outdo each other for now. The three of you have decided to pull the arrow out together. Let's go. Time Let's do for this. Some action. You grasp the arrow. Akiiko and Shinji stand behind you. This arrow seems to be especially deep. Alright, let's go. 
The other two pull on, uh, pull on you as hard as they can. You have to make sure not to let go of the arrow. <laughs> the two of them pull even harder. You pull out the arrow. <sighs> Nice, we got the number 66. <laughs> Guess that was a whole cake. Good grief. <laughs> yeah. You should report to the nurse's office later. <laughs>